So right now, I'll show you real quick what I'm doing. Today's video is going to be super short, and I am making custom start button stickers. Being that there's no cheap option to a custom start button, and I wanted something unique and really cool, I decided why not just make one out of vinyl. So what I'm doing right now is I'm actually pulling out my already customized start button that I already made. Um, that was what the clips were before. And now I'm going to try some other designs on it as well as also test fit them. Because this original design is just a hair off and I want these to be perfect. I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's a little bit of a white line on this side. That's because it's slightly off and then it kind of goes under on this side. So I tried to make it go over that way. Let's see how the new ones fit. They're not teal because I don't have enough teal vinyl, but we'll see. Essentially you just peel this away. In this current state, it's just missing the inner portion of the A. But the rest of it's all there. And then I'm gonna try and line it up as best as I can. And you start with the LED button, then the G, then the A. And the rest should fall into place. I don't know if you guys can see this, but this one actually lines up perfectly. It is a lighter color, and it is peeling back a bit just because it hasn't been heated at all. This is actually done perfectly. If I were to put the carbon ring back on, which isn't exactly perfect, but it looks perfect. This is an idea. That's what it would look like. So basically, I ended up trying all these different styles. I wanted to see cutouts with my own custom look, how they would look. I wanted to try different thicknesses of uh, vinyls on top of the buttons. And they all turned out really cool. Of course, I didn't heat them, so they weren't perfect. Then I came up with my final style. A nice blue, and it has been released on Instagram already, and I have shown this off. But essentially, I wanted something special. Something that if I push my start button, I'll feel super happy about, and it just looks fantastic. So right now, I'm actually making these buttons if anyone wants one. I will be making the center of the button. I am not making the outer rings just yet, but those will be soon. I want to make the outer rings out of Vivid, just because it has a really nice realistic carbon fiber look that's dark. So it gives like an almost sinister look too. And overall, if you have any other real carbon fiber in the interior, it'll match really well. Then for the center start button, I can make this out of any color vinyl. I recommend anything off Metro Restyling because they only have high quality vinyls on Metro Restyling. They don't even carry Vivid because Vivid's not always perfect. So you can have this in red, green, purple, whatever the hell you want and have any design in the center. Just because I show off this JS design doesn't mean that you can have whatever you want. Oh yeah, that's just this video. I wanted to make it really quick and I had to re-edit this just because the last one just took so long and I went off on a whole nother tangent, which I really shouldn't be doing in my video. From now on, if any of you want these, you can DM me on Instagram. I am making them. I'm just gonna say 10 bucks for now, just so then it covers everything. So if you want it to look like the stock style, you can. If you want a custom logo, you can. Anything off of Metro Restyling site, and that includes shipping and everything. So it's just 10 bucks flat, and then you get your start button sent to you in the mail. I hope you enjoyed this video. It is a very cheap option. Just saying, instead of like a TRD start button or the Tom's one, it gives you a whole custom look as well, which I really like. And at night, technically the lights do show through on certain vinyls, especially this blue. So it still says engine start stop at night. The light does come through, but it still does look really cool. And it actually kind of peeks out more around the JS and kind of like illuminates the JS a little bit. It's weird. But I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you're interested, like I said before, DM me on Instagram. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out and be legendary. Baby, please have mercy on me. Take it easy on my heart.